Hello friends, in this video we will see a problem in which we have to calculate the viscosity of a fluid which is flowing between two plates. So let us take the question over that. A plate 0.025 mm distant from a fixed plate moves at 60 cm per second and requires a force of 2 Newton per unit area to maintain this speed full stop determine the fluid viscosity between the plates so this is the question which we have now whatever is given here I will write that in the form of data first so let me start with this problem here it is said that determine the fluid viscosity between the two plates Here we are having these two plates and in between them the fluid is flowing. Now a plate 0.025 mm distant the distance between the plate it is given this I will denote it by dy so dy is 0.025 mm or I can say that it is 0 0.025 into 10 raised to minus 3 meter next moves at 60 centimeter per second the velocity is given so here I will write down u it is equal to 60 centimeter per second in other words it is 60 here it is centimeter and 1 centimeter is equal to 10 raised to minus 2 meter. So it is 60 into 10 raised to minus 2 meter per second. Here simply centimeter per second I am converting it, it into meter per second. So 1 centimeter is replaced by 10 raised to minus 2 meter. Next requires a force of 2 Newton per unit area to maintain this speed. So the force offered by the fluid on the plate it is 2 Newton per unit area in other words it is 2 Newton area I will denote it by meter square so 2 Newton per meter square that is nothing but stress and here it is called as shear stress. So force of 2 Newton per unit area force per unit area is stress so here it is shear stress because flowing fluid will, would be having layers which are going to shear now determine the fluid viscosity if they are saying only viscosity the meaning is we have to calculate dynamic viscosity mu because if they are saying to calculate kinematic viscosity then it would be mentioned but since here only viscosity has been said it means it is dynamic viscosity now with these much data available let us try to get the solution for this problem I'll say that since the velocity of fluid it is denoted by du and that is equal to the final velocity minus initial and since only one velocity of value of velocity is given so du is equal to u and that is 60 into 10 raised to minus 2 meter per second therefore and even the distance between the plates is given that is dy is equal to 0 0.025 into 10 raised to minus 3 meters now since the question is to find dynamic viscosity and we have dynamic viscosity in the formula of shear stress so I will say that also shear stress is given by tau is equal to mu into du by dy because we know from Newton's law of viscosity this is the relation of shear stress therefore I will put the values here tau 
it is given it is 2 newton per meter square mu is what we have to calculate du it is 60 into 10 raised to minus 2 dy 0 0.025 into 10 raised to minus 3 so therefore mu will be equal to 2 into this denominator which is it would be multiplied 0 0.025 into 10 raised to minus 3 divided by 60 into 10 raised to minus 2 so from this I am getting my dynamic viscosity answer as 8.33 into 10 raised to minus 5 Newton second per meter square so here I have the answer of dynamic viscosity and if I see into the question they were telling us to get the value of viscosity and that viscosity is nothing but kinematic viscosity the so dynamic viscosity mind you it is not kinematic viscosity the problem was to determine fluid viscosity between two plates so the viscosity of the fluid we have found out it is 8.33 into 10 raised to minus 5 newton second per meter square and with this we complete this question